Oh, you know, I kind of feel the, uh, the pain that you're feeling in this question That's because right. you want to join with your husband's spirit. You want to kind of grieve and walk through this process with him, and he's being very private about it. And uh, it's not an uncommon thing for yeah. men to do this. Actually, the truth is, for women, when we are stressed, when we are emotionally devastated, our instincts, everything in us tells us to make a connection. That is what relieves the stress. It's actually the opposite in the male right. gender. When men are feeling under pressure, when they're feeling stressed, when, they, when they're uh, confused emotionally, they withdraw and they try to get some time alone, some time away to regroup, and that feels so counter to us. Well, and even even other men, their friends will just say, "Hey, right. you know, just give him some space right now." And whereas in a group of women, it's like you gather around, you're touching, you're holding hands, it's you know sharing, and right. it's just a very different emotional grieving process for men and women, for in general, not always, but That's in general. That's exactly right. And and here's the deal. But we do have a service to play. We want to be connected. We want to be supportive. And sometimes we can even give words to feelings that men are, can't even articulate. Women have a better feeling vocabulary than most men. Right. A larger one. I don't mean a better one, but a larger <laughs> one because we're just, we live more in our feelings. Well, and that's why it's sometimes important in your situation. Here's what I'd recommend yeah. is that you jot a note every uh so often to him about the process just to let him know you're with him That's right. and that kind of gives him his space but it also says I'm here with you mm -hmm. and when you need me to kind of be closer in this situation I'm right here by your side That's right. and uh, kind of helping him articulate some of the pain and, and uh, grief that he's experiencing in your notes is going to let him know you're with him. Um, and, uh, and, and there might be some active things that you can do that can act out some of that. Um, some, you know, some things you can do that would help the process. It might be remembering. It might be mm -hmm. even laughing over happy memories of the father that was lost. Or, or finding some memento in your home right. that is going to be meaningful. I'm thinking of a couple that we saw recently, and she found a, a photograph in the attic and uh, brought it to her husband. A very similar situation right. to yours, and it just meant so much to him. And uh, so it was just kind of a, a gentle way of saying, I'm here, I'm with mm -hmm. you, but I want to respect your space as well.